Muzammil from the Emirates. Now, I don't know how to approach my neighbors. So basically, I never talk to them because we live in an uh, apartment. Plus, my parents don't let me randomly knock their door and socialize because they want me to mind my own business. Is this okay? Okay. I will answer Muzammil you, from the Emirates. He says that I am not a very social person. My parents prohibit me from knocking on my neighbor's doors and I'd wonder how would I socialize with them, how to establish a relationship. Am I sinful for not doing that? The answer is no. You're not sinful because you are not doing something evil or bad to them. And part of honoring your neighbors is to prevent th them from getting any wrongdoings from your side. So this is level one. I don't throw trash in front of their door. I don't blow music up so that it would wake them in the middle of the night or not make them concentrate. I don't uh, um, uh, peek and try to eavesdrop or to look at auras here and there of my neighbors. So this is level one. Level two, which is the best and highest, is to be kind to them, to send them food in Ramadan, some sambusa, some shorba, some soup. Um, if they need um, a, a hand while moving something heavy, you volunteer to do that. If they need assistance in something that is halal, you volunteer to do that. That is a higher level. But nowadays, in concrete uh, uh, boxes that we live in, usually people are intimidated when you give salam or you volunteer to give a helping hand. So if you find that the consequence of your action and, 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 and volunteering is positive, go ahead and do it. If not, just keep your distance until the right time comes.